Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody posted this file on, I am thinking on my Facebook page, and want to know how they could engrave the whole thing, but just cut out the inner part. I'm not sure why they wouldn't want to cut out the outer part too, but maybe they're doing something with the inner parts. First of all, this is really crude, so I, I semi-redrew it real fast. It's a little bit off. But we're going to use the Smart Fill tool, but we're going to use it a little bit different than we normally use it, or I normally use it. I'm going to go to Smart Fill. I'm going to have no fill, but I'm going to specify a hairline in red. So before we do anything, we want to see how big this thing is. is 8.285 inches tall. Our nudge factor is 10. So we're going to grab the Smart Fill tool, and we're going to click on the inside parts. And all I'm doing is making a hairline, cut line, for all the inside parts. And you see I'm doing it in spreading uh, just any pattern, but you could see whether you've got them all by doing this. And then just nudge them back. So if you sent this to your laser as a combination job, it's going to engrave that line, and then it's going to cut that line. So it's going to cut all the interior parts. It's a pretty cool design. Let's just uh, real quick just fill it in using the Smart Fill tool, but this time take away no outline, and we'll use specify black, and let's fill in the parts, and you can kind of just see uh, how it kind of put together. It's a... Uh, I'm trying to talk and make sure I get all the parts. Anyway, that's what it would look like in wood. And then, of course, if you took the, the interior parts and cut them out. I hope that helped them a little bit. Thank you for watching.